The mid-market has surprised me. Um, I kind of appreciated it. it was an important part of the economy, but what I didn't appreciate was that it actually adds up to about 47% of the GDP in Australia, and it accounts for 3.2 million jobs, so it's an incredibly important part of the Australian economy. The mid-market in Australia is, is one of sort of our sort of forgotten heroes. It's really, it is one of the workhorses of the Australian economy in terms of job creation. Yes, the, the, the big end of town gets a lot of focus and attention and there's no doubt about its role, but it's really the, the mid-market that plays service to that big end of town, to government and to the rest of the economy uh, that drives the Australian economy. It's about a partnership, it's, it's genuine uh, knowledge it's genuine uh, range of services and advice that's going to partner with those companies through these more difficult and uncertain times. I think that's vitally important. And it doesn't just mean offering more credit. Credit's an important part of the story, don't get me wrong. But a lot of these companies don't actually need more credit. What they're looking for is, is genuine advice and services that's going to help grow their business. We think GE Capital can help in, a, in, in four main ways. Uh, the first way is really innovation. Uh, Mid-market companies that have spent more on research and development typically outperform those that don't. The second area is really around talent management. Again, the challenges that they're facing is really how do you attract, retain and grow talent. We're going to just help them be much better talent managers and build much stronger management cultures. The third area is really around customer focus and channel management. And what we think we can do is give them access to much better research techniques so they can build really good insights. And then finally, it's really around geographic reach and diversity. Mid-market companies in Australia, they compete against multinationals. So what we want to do is give them access to lessons around global supply chains and give them access to lower costs and also global customers who might be operating in Australia. So we think with those four um, sources of assistance, mid-market companies can continue to be very successful. Thank you.